अपॉर्चुनिटी नहीं मिलती है वो वेट करते हैं कि मैं और 12 साल 13 साल 15 साल क्रॉस करूं, अपनी हाई स्कूल अपनी कॉलेज खत्म करूं, फिर उसके बाद मैं कंपटीशन के लिए अप्लाई करूं, फिर वो मैं कोच कब बनूंगा तो हमने ये डिसाइड किया है कि हम टीन एजर्स को ही हम वो कंपटीशन में आने का पार्टिसिपेशन का ऑप्शन दे रहे हैं और वो भी सेपरेट कैटेगरी हमें ये नहीं चाहिए कि वो सीनियर कैटेगरी के साथ खेलें जो कि ट्वेंटी फोर के ऊपर है एंड दे विल से यार उनका जेनेटिक हम बीट नहीं कर सकते बीट द जेनेटिक ऑफ द गाइज मोर दैन दैम तो दैट इज़ द रीज़न हमने ये कॉन्सेप्ट लाया है कि यार एक काम करते हैं पंद्रह साल से लेके सोलह साल वालों के लिए एक जूनियर एस्थेटिक एक एस्थेटिक एक ऐसा वर्ड है इट्स इट डिफाइंस द ब्यूटी ब्यूटी ऑफ द फिजिक राइट जेफ द मीनिंग ऑफ द एस्थेटिक इज तो हमने उसे एक कैटेगरी दे दिया है और हमने यूथ के लिए फिफ्टीन टू एटीन ईयर्स के एक स्पेसिफिक कैटेगरी रखी है और हम उन्हें स्टेज पर जब हमें बुलाएंगे तो हम उनको हाइट और वेट के हिसाब से नहीं गिरा रहे इट्स रैंडम पिकअप वो अपने आएंगे अपने टोकन नंबर के हिसाब से और वो अपने ही एज कैटेगरी के साथ ही खेलेंगे तो जिसके अंदर एज वेट सब कुछ सिमिलर होगा इट इज इजी टू कॉम्पिट इट इज वेरी फेयर इन द मार्केट जो कि जो कि पूरा डिफरेंट कॉन्सेप्ट है एंड दैट इज द रीजन वी हैव हिम ऑन द बोर्ड हु इज द मास्टर ऑफ सिमेट्री जो इतने बॉलीवुड एक्टर्स को ट्रेन किए हैं ही इज अ मास्टर नॉलेजेबल गाय एंड ही नोज इट बेटर दैट इज द रीजन आई हैव हिम इन द बोर्ड ऑफकोर्स तो तो क्या किया गया था और कुछ नया फोन किया था मैंने हाँ ही बोल दिया था इनको मैंने मैंने मतलब दस मिनट कॉन्वर्सेशन में मैंने इनको हाँ बोल दिया था मैं कॉन्सेप्ट समझता था और ये एक बहुत अच्छा प्लेटफॉर्म है तो मैंने बोला क्यों नहीं एक पार्ट बन जाओ बहुत बहुत अच्छी टीम है जिसके साथ काम करें क्यों नहीं एक पार्ट पार्ट ऑफ दिस टीम बन जाओ तो मैंने तुरंत नहीं दस मिनट में आए हुआ हाँ बोल दिया मतलब वो ऐसा हुआ कि आई जस्ट कॉल्ड हिम लाइक मतलब समीर भाई आपका तो नाम चलता है इंडस्ट्री में ऐसा कौन सा पॉपुलर एक्टर है जिसको आपने नहीं किया है ट्रेन और आपका ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन वो दुनिया बात करती है हमें तो बोलने की ज़रूरत ही नहीं है वो मूवी में ही दिख जाता है वो कैरेक्टर में दिख जाता है तो मैंने कहा कि यार मैं एक अप्रूवल लेके आया मैं एक अप्रोच लेके आया हूँ आपके पास ये कॉन्सेप्ट है बोले आपका कॉन्सेप्ट तो बहुत अलग है मार्केट से बोला हाँ वही है बोला अभी आई वॉन्ट यू टू बी द जज इज लाइक जज बोला या बोला आप पहले इंडिया से दिस इज द न्यू थिंग कि किसी ट्रेनर या किसी कोच को हम प्लेटफॉर्म दे रहे हैं इंडिया में एज अ जज बनने के लिए दस फॉर एन इंटरनेशनल शो इट्स अ ह्यूज प्लेटफॉर्म एंड समथिंग न्यू कॉन्सेप्ट इन द मार्केट क्यों नहीं नॉलेज बांटने से कम नहीं होती है ऑफकोर्स <laughs> Tell us about your collaboration. With Jeff. Tell us about Jeff. your collaboration. Collaboration. Your and mine collaboration. That's for God's sake, production and Jeff's side team, bro. I mean, he's like how we collaborated. They want to know from you. Oh yeah, well we started out as friends, and we had this idea that kind of um, first started as a seed, and it just blossomed into what it is today. So when when they have told you about the concept, what was your reaction? Uh, well, we came up to it together. So they didn't really come up to me with the idea. We thought of it. We concept. thought about it together. Yeah. He is the concept man. He is the concept. So basically, <laughs> it was very mutual. And we have noticed that, like random comments, we have noticed that, that in their followers, there were some random comments that, uh, why don't you organize your own show? If you organize it, then we will play in it. It will be this or that. So I, I actually translated him in Hindi because. is i mean you, he has a first ranking in india in fan following so i translated him in goa and that's where he's like are you sure like yeah let me go with jeff side classic and that's where we created the name beach pe baith kar bade chill out ho ke hum baat kar rahe the and that's where at the beach we were chilling out yeah having food nice time and that's where we discussed and he's like okay let's go for it fir humne 6 mahine ka homework kiya operations mein to understand ke baaki jo shows ho rahe hain market mein to aisa kya hai jo unhone miss kiya और ऐसा क्या है जो हम ऐड कर सकते हैं एंड दैट इज द रीजन हमारे शो का पहला की ये है कि ऐसे कंपनीज को लाना ऑन बोर्ड जो कि मार्केट में बहुत वैल्यू लगती है विच इज़ वन ऑफ द कंपनीज कॉल ई एस एन मैं खुद उसे लेता हूँ आई हैव एक्सपीरियंस द क्वालिटी एंड उसके उनके जितने भी जो एथलीट्स हैं इनफैक्ट इवन दे आर वेरी मच दे हैव क्वालिफाइड दे हैव वन मेनी कॉम्पिटिशन सो आई एम ग्लैड ही कमिंग ऑन बोर्ड एंड आई वुड लव टू नो ब्रो आई मीन वॉट वॉज यूर एक्सपीरियंस बनाया अप्रोच यू 
So when I when when Hamdan spoke to me, it took me like five minutes, I think. Yeah. I told him, you know what, we're on. We'll discuss the formalities later. Let's do this because the concept is beautiful. Yeah. So uh, tell us about your your collaboration with them and what uh, what is the USP of the show? What is the USP of the show? The key element, 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 uh, well, uh, the competition is just yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, promote aesthetics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to promote a healthy, natural lifestyle to all the athletes out there, and we want to give people an opportunity where they can expand their careers. Everyone wants to, you know, get into social media and make money out of it. So we want to give people the opportunity to actually make money. We see all these competitions out there where you might get like a plastic, like little metal or something like this, and it doesn't really have much worth. So that's why we're giving out you know, prizes like cash prizes and giant trophies and health insurance. We're giving job opportunities with Fitzo, we're giving supplement sponsors. So it's not just, they're not just getting a trophy, they're getting something that can expand their career. Although so it's a lot more than just yeah. winning a competition, this is something that can of course. further your career. So it's it's a lot more than just winning competition. More than that, because um, kaisa hai na, ki abhi ek, uh, saal se leke saal ke liye aur जो 18 साल के बाद जो ग्रीक गॉड जो कैटेगरी है जो कि एक सीनियर पोजीशन कैटेगरी है इट्स कॉल्ड ग्रीक गॉड जिसे लोग मेंस फिजिक भी कहते हैं राइट समीर भाई तो उन लोगों के लिए इन फिटनेस इंडस्ट्री में कमाना साल साल की मेहनत कर रहा हम उन्हें तीन लाख रुपए कैश दे रहे हैं विच इज अ रिवॉर्ड अमाउंट इट्स अ बिग थिंग अगर एक पंद्रह साल से लेके अठारह साल का जो हमने जो जो फर्स्ट कॉन्सेप्ट जो लॉन्च कर रहे हैं यहाँ पे विच इज जूनियर स्टेटिक अगर उस बंदे को तीन लाख रुपये मिलेगा इट्स अज मनी फॉर हेम वो इन्वेस्ट कर सकता है एक टीनेजर अपने घर पे कुछ एक अमाउंट लेके जा रहा है पढ़ाई कर सकता है मोर ओवर बहुत बार ऐसा होता है कि जब हम कोई कंपटीशन खेलते हैं ना तो वो लोग है ना अपने प्रोफाइल पे डाल देते हैं वन सो एंड सो कंपटीशन, वन जेफ साइड क्लासिक कंपटीशन। लोग देखते हैं वो ना अपनी प्रोफाइल क्रिएट करते कि हमने कुछ कॉम्पिटिशन जीता है फिर ऐसी रेपूटेड कंपनीज आती है मार्केट में जो उन्हें एज अ स्पॉन्सर एथलीट लेती है ताकि उन्हें प्रोटीन सप्लाई टाइम पर मिले Promotion is a different part of the story, but the company like this comes in the picture so that their struggle is maintained. Food, food is important, key, but what about supplements? It's an essential, it's required. Hai. It's very important. Samir, you would agree with me? 100%. Supplements are the key factor. It's a key factor. Supplement is not body, it's not difficult. But when we talk about professionalism, it is very much important. That's why ESN, come as, I mean, ESN has come on the board. And I really thank I mean, Atike to come on the board and making the take in the initiative. Moreover, जब बंदा उसे competition पे ये तो मिल जाएगा sponsorship. उसके बाद क्या? वो अपना profile create करने में time मेहनत करेगा. हमारे show में उसको वही करने की ज़रूरत नहीं है, क्योंकि there is a company called Fitzo, जो कि आप notice कर सकते हैं. Here, they are giving a straight job opportunity right on the spot. वो भी तीन साल के लिए. It's a huge thing. I mean, तुमने competition जीता है. You take the cash prize, you take the certificate. You get a sponsorship, you get a sponsorship from the alkaline, and what? You get a, you get an opportunity to train with him, which is a celebrity trainer, plus Fitzu offers a job opportunity right straight for three years. Teen saal ka job opportunity. Online training. Tumari profile achche se create hoti hai, online jati hai, aur un logo ki list mein, jo industry mein already kafi popular hai. It's a big stage. Agar kal ja ke, it's, it's a big platform. I mean, I know who are high profile people, their profile is already online. So, they have mentioned their experience. I will go directly to a random man. Okay, their profile is good. I will be going to training under him. His budget is suitable. The person is sitting at home. Exactly. His income is starting. We are giving him a 360 package. We are giving him a job opportunity. Which is an important key. We are giving him a struggle. We are giving him a little bit of a shortcut. That is where Jeff Said Classic ka jo judging panel is very strict hai, and that is the reason we have a very strict judge, one of the strict judge here. Where is the very strict judge? He is one of the senior judge. Tell us about your journey, about when you started this 
started uh, doing tripping, anything that inspires you, and how you are like uh, right now, and, and how people, uh, uh, I mean, get motivated by you. Anything that you want to share? How you started it, and how you are right now? The journey, your journey. My journey, huh? Well, Fuck, I started a long time ago when I was 11 years old. That's when I started working out. I asked my parents for a weight set for my 11th birthday. Luckily, they were supportive, and you know they bought it for me. Initially, it was just for sports to get like a competitive edge. After about six months, I saw a very big transformation in my physique, and it, it turned into a passion of mine. I didn't really know about the whole bodybuilding scene until I was a senior in high school. So up until then, I had just been working out because I loved it. And uh, once I find out, I found out about social media, you know, in the bodybuilding world and competing. That's when it really kind of went to the next level. I started kind of turning it into a career. Uh, after that, I mean, just kind of went from one thing to the next, and here I am now. And when Jeff left uh, powerlifting, he was a wrestler too. If you don't know anyone, he didn't know anyone. He started wrestling in the starting. And when Jeff jumped into uh, fitness modeling, he was one of the youngest uh, pro holder. Then I started fitness ka chaska chada. So I was inspired by Jeff Inspire Jeff. And I was a fanboy, like a literally fanboy. I don't know Jeff is. See, he's laughing because it's so unexpected that I admire him. Today, I have pictures of Jeff's pictures on my phone. I mean, wallpaper. Pe. Because I used to admire his physique. He's a natural guy. He knows in and out about aesthetics. I was with Jeff as much as I was when I became friends with him. I knew that I was a fanboy. I got his answer mujhe tab mila because in their dedication, in their discipline, I really don't think in the industry they will follow karte honge. Har do ghante mein khana because you need to stay natural, essentials time pe lena, discipline. Har time pe khana, pani pina, it's not that easy. Kabi kabi insaan na irritated ho jata. Gadi gadi khane mein, chawane mein. But to create that physique, he had the discipline. That's where I admire him. No matter, we are friends. We're doing business together, but I'm still a small fanboy inside. That's gonna be there. Oh boy. Yeah, that's gonna be staying inside, of course. El time. Me? He he'll start and I'll say. You go ahead. So he had a question. Like you want to be like you anything that you want to say to them. them. Like them motivated. I'm, I'm, so basically he's saying that um anyone in, in the youth who would like to be you, like you, what uh, is what is what you can suggest them? What is the tip you can give? Yeah, well, one of the biggest things is you got to realize that it's not going to happen overnight. So once you put in the work, you know, it's not going to happen overnight, but over years and years of consistency and hard work, anyone can build a good physique, okay? The, the beauty about aesthetics is it's a universal language. It does not matter what language you speak, aesthetics and a beautiful physique can apply to anyone. So it doesn't matter what country you live on Earth, if you see a good physique, you can admire it. So that's one of the great things about aesthetics is I, I personally believe that anyone can achieve it. So it doesn't matter what your body type is like, you know, where you're starting out. It's, if you put in the work, you can achieve it as well. I think consistency and hard work. Yeah, it's all about discipline, yeah. actually. Yeah, it's all about discipline, yeah. Oh, Jeff said classical, judging panel. How much you love your body? Jeff said classical. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And you got to enjoy it, too. It's yeah, a passion. Yeah, you're okay? really passionate. And, and come on, I mean, I've been training for 15 years. So again, it's not going to happen overnight. But once you love it, if you're doing what you love, it's just going to turn into a passion and you're going to yeah. enjoy it. And that's what really matters at the end of the day. Is there anything you would like to add? Uh, about, about the, the protein part and the of course. important part? And yeah, Atike must speak here. Yeah. I mean, you should, you should of course. I mean, see, Atike is the, he's a very silent guy actually. What's true for that? But then he is like a under the mark moon kinas of chalta arch ones of protein banana. As a kuchia banana, you have kuch yoga. Matlab mene in ki factory me jack him an experience ki hai. And honestly speaking, I had a very great, great experience in ESN factory. One of the cleanest so far with my experience. Or just a sub saint ki company kam karti hai. Promotion ki sub saint ki kam karti hai. Wo mahal ki sub se kam karti hai. In ki company ko pata hai ki market me requirement kya hai. लोग बोलते हैं कि इसमें ये इश्यूज़ हैं, वो इश्यूज़ हैं, ठीक है, शुगर ज़्यादा है, इनका नेक्स्ट ब्रांड ऐसा निकलता है, इसमें शुगर ही नहीं होता। So he is a creative guy, I like the concept, इनके डॉक्टर्स काफी एक्सपर्ट हैं। He has one of the doctors जिन्होंने मुझे मिलाया, उन्होंने आइडिया शेयर किया। Almost इनके सारे ब्रांड मैंने टेस्ट कर चुका ह
Yeah, we literally were just at their manufacturer like earlier today. It's like five minutes away. So before you partner with someone, we want to see how the process works. You know, we want to see how professional they are. And after seeing their manufacturer, very, very clean, very good products. We tested all the products and everything was, was top notch. It's very good. I've tried a lot of products in America and ESN is definitely the top products that we've tried. So that's why I want to bring them on board because it's not just another cell phone company. They're one of the best. Of course, That's what we want to give to everyone else. Exactly. Jeff, ESN ko buy, buy kaza. Maine aur Jeff ne dono ne test kiya. Main ESN pehle se leta hi hu. As an as, main khud ek international fitness athlete hu. Maine khud ne industry mein almost seven years complete kiye. I know ke jab maine modeling shows kiye the, isme super model Mumbai jab main jita tha, us dooran pe jab mujhe jo physique chahiye tha, main ESN hi use karta tha. Maine promote bhi kiya kabi ESN, but main kabi main ESN ke baare mein itna mujhe pata nahi tha ki market mein itni creative hai. मार्केट में एक नया ब्रांड आता था ऑनलाइन देख लिया परचेस कर लिया धीरे धीरे पता चला लाइफ इज सो अनएक्सपेक्टेड के ऐसा एक टाइम आ गया कि मैं आज उनके मतलब उस कंपनी के ओनर के साथ बैठा हूँ एंड इज देर ऑन बोर्ड हैप्पी टू बी विथ हिम इज अम्बल का इज डूइंग गुड इन द मार्केट एंड इनकी कंपनी चाहती है कि एथलीट्स को कुछ मिले ऐसा नहीं है कि बस जो मार्केट में आ गया बस ये बी डबल ए डाल दिया ये डाल दिया ऐसा नहीं है इनके एक एक प्रोडक्ट में एक डिफरेंट क्वालिटी है एक इफेक्ट है जो मैंने और जेफ ने आज ही हमने वो रिसेंटली टेस्ट किया है एंड वी डेफिनेटली अप्रूव एंड वी अग्री टू द फैक्ट दैट यस दे डेफिनेटली डिजर्व टू बी देयर ऑन जेफ साइड क्लास दे आर हैप्पी इन फैक्ट सिंस दे आर देर ऑन बोर्ड आई मीन हमें पता है कि हमारे एथलीट जो जीतेंगे वो इस कंपनी में जा रहे हैं एज अ स्पॉन्सर एथलीट वी आर वेरी प्राउड ऑनस्टली आई मीन आर रिस्पेक्ट दिस गाय Yeah, Fitso is a uh, it's a great great new company that is offering trainers a uh, platform to offer their services. So it's a unique company that is um, that can apply to everyone really. So that's why we want to give one of the prizes that we're giving is a job opportunity. So what Fitso is giving is a three year job pretty much. Uh, is there anything you want to add to it? Yeah, that's right. Basically, uh, for us, it's a big opportunity here. Basically, work with Jeff Fitz Club, Jeff Fitz Club, and uh, I'm sure that we'll be finding the, the winners themselves will be very knowledgeable people. So to have them on board with us to basically train the clientele that we'll be giving to them is a great opportunity for us also. But how did you came up with an idea? How much have you spent in the gym? Say what? Uh, let's see. It's uh, maybe two to three hours a day, six days a week. <laughs> 15 years. Okay. You do the math. Last week we want to learn from you. How was your collaboration with them, and what will be your part? What will be my part? I should actually know that till now, but very, very possibly I will be one of the judges. I think for the women category because the men. I like you all, but I want to see you all dressed. <laughs> no, 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 I'm just kidding. Um, mostly I will be the judging the... Uh, She'll be handling the bikini part because um, woman physique can only a woman can judge. That is more better. It will be unfair that we put our own judgment. Because we know what men's is. Women category is always what we want to take care of. And I really trust her. She's the right person. She can go through. I mean, um, definitely. She's the right choice. So you have done any preparation for that? Yeah. So the problem is like problem or solution that for every uh, every competition you get like a book which you have to study with all the judging things, right? So once I will get it, I will start to go through it because we already know, no, bikini is not the the main thing and all that stuff. So you have to like for example, tattoos are allowed or not, etc., etc. So that all of these things we have to. Uh, we have to know, we have to go through it, and we have to be consensual, right, for in for men's and women's body. Once we we are okay with everything, we we will study it, and then we will judge on that uh, on that parameters. Jeff said, classic, uh, like like what typical bodybuilding show, nahi hai. हम वो ही समझाना चाह रहे हैं राइट समीर भाई हाँ अगर किसी को लग रहा है कि लाइक जेफ सेट क्लासिक इज अ बॉडी बिल्डिंग शो बॉडी बिल्डर्स देखोगे वो सब नहीं होने वाला वो नहीं होने वाला जब आई मीन जेफ सेट क्लासिक नॉट अबाउट टिपिकल बिग ह्यूज बॉडी बिल्डिंग इट्स नॉट दैट इट्स ऑल अबाउट स्थेरिक आई मीन डू सी हिस्स लाइक ह्यूज बॉडी बिल्डर नो ही गोट राइट प्रपोर्शन राइट सिमेट्री आपने जो बीच बॉडीज देखी है ना टू मेक यू अंडरस्टैंड वो जब 
It's all about that. Yeah, I mean, एक अच्छा decent, एक एक model physique जो होता है, जो हर कोई admire करता है, वो reach करता है, हम उन्हें ज़्यादा वो platform दे रहे हैं basically. क्योंकि आजकल लोगों को क्या हो गया ना कि मुझे body building में जाना है, तो मुझे वो unwanted drugs लेने पड़ेंगे, मुझे उतना gigantic break देखना पड़ेगा, नहीं, जैसे classic में हम आपको stress दे ही नहीं रहे, आपको and the best aesthetic physique will be the best person who has muscle quality and preparation. We are going to check everything up to date. We have kept certain bifurcations. On that basis, all the judges who are sitting, I am not a judge. I am just going to handle the operation part. He is the right person to judge. He is the right person to judge. I think he would be there because if he is going to choose the main model of his face, he definitely has the right to take a chance and see which athlete is going to come on board. So yeah. Thank you. Thank you.